Okay, we're back. We're gonna work on the top part of the hood and the canopy today. So I got two scraps. I just went ahead and taped them together and put a center line down the middle. Makes things a lot easier. So let's get started. <laughs> Makes sense. Measure from the wrong line. There's the edge and then there's a crooked line. I measure from a crooked line. Cutting things with scissors. Believe it or not, scissors have a curve. Some worse than others. The curve nonetheless. Everything has a slight angle on it. I mean, just a slight angle. You wouldn't realize that by watching the cartoon. You, you, you would almost think this whole thing was basically one giant rectangle. Even the tiny Hot Wheels. 
car has these slight angles. And it's not enough, it's not enough to the eye while you're looking at it to catch, but it is when you're doing it. So. I'll give you an example here in just a second. Let me make this line. Run. Just a quick thing from here to this part of the front end to the back of the canopy here, this side here, because this top is angled in. Uh, it doesn't look like there's nothing, you know, width wise, but there's actually in a 61 centimeter length, there's actually a difference of three centimeters. It's a pretty good big gap, which just uh, times. Uh, let's see. Like I said, it's something you can you can't notice it on the TV show or the toy, but it's there. Don't do what I do. Alright, like 
like the I don't like the blade itself. I want to pull in, to pull, pull into a curve. First time I had that, had to that. Yeah, yeah, that's better. Let's see if the old blade do weird things. What I done? I stuck the stuck a blade in a de uh, dead skin on my hand. See if it poke. It. Don't about sticking a red blade in the hand. See if it's gonna cut. But I'm crazy about that. Ugh. Crap, I wish I could make these things smaller. This part here, the end's gonna be overlapped. What I'm gonna try to do is use this same pattern for the top since the base actually is larger than the top of the can. So I've got giant pieces of scrap that are just too... Don't tell me this would have worked. Well, of course it would have worked. I already had a piece. I kind of guessed it made it be too big. small all wrong. So I wasted this giant piece of paper for nothing. Well, there's our pattern. Uh, we're going to end this probably 15 minute video. So we're just going to go ahead and end that. And we'll come back. We'll work on making a pattern or cardboard. Thank you. Watch and see you next time.